Oh well, hello there guys, welcome back. I hope you're doing well. And this is Arma 3. Now, I am sorry that I was busy. Uh, I was busy because I am sorting out some of the stuff in my life between this work and like uh, I was under like a little bit of problem. I didn't have time to upload videos also. I recently switched my job. So I'm kinda okay now with the situation and let's just skip that now. This game Arma 3 I have a lot of memories and this was the first game which brought me into online gaming now let's get out from there because it's too noisy now back when I didn't own this game I there was this community called Tungle where you can play um, like cracked games pirated games in through online this community was known as Tungle and like some of you watching this video might heard about it because you are playing Arma 3 and there were like tons and tons of players playing Arma 3 every day from all over the country so I was one of them you don't need to pay anything just download the software and you just play it with your friends you know um, so later Tungle community was shut down so this was just a backstory of me getting into Arma 3 and falling in love with this game so um, let's get back to the video so right now I am using my potato PC which is a i5-3570 and a GTX 1650 which is like three or four years old by now and I am running everything on full HD and look at my um, visibility and I am running everything on ultra here if you look at my NTLS it's on 4x all freeze and grass SMMA everything is on high but I get over 60 to 50 FPS in this game even with a lot of AIs around over there and this is actually a huge mission so how do i get such good frames all right so just watch my video so i'm going to exit my game save and exit just quit the game now the important thing that you want to do is go to your parameters in Arma 3 launcher of course and here you can set your CPU count that will be under advanced in parameters so here I am having a really old 4 core CPU so I have set manually the cores that I have here for and extra threads I have enabled them and also enabled hyper threading okay make sure you don't allow this or check mark this because this can mess up for uh, some computers as I have used before so, okay so the next thing that you want to do is go to your defender now this is an important step okay so if you go to your defender and you must turn off the real time protection because why is that this thing always run on your background it might um, spike up something like this see this now is using over 100 megabyte just 100 megabyte of RAM out of my 16 GB is used by this thing so make sure you turn off this um, defender and make sure you have no programs running in background for example um, Adobe stuff like Creative Cloud and all those Let's see photos is running you can always exit that and make sure everything is clean alright and also set up this you can play with a lot of mods I do have a lot of mods here installed 
So this is just a quick video and an update about me and that's it guys I am back I will hopefully I will upload videos regularly and my channel has hit over like 100 subscribers and thank you for that and I will keep uploading good videos for you guys that's it thank you for watching my video and I'll see you in the next one goodbye